All right, what's up? Back with the Eliminator once again. Welcome everyone back to another video on the channel. In today's video, some more Eliminator. It's been a little bit now since I played, uh, a couple of weeks actually. So I want to actually get back on the Eliminator grind and try to win a bunch of games because it's been a while since I've won and it's been a while since I've played properly. The last time that I was uh, that I played, I just played poorly. It was just bad. However, however, I did get screwed over. A little bit, all right. I, I I can say that I got screwed over a little bit because I did, right? Especially with the way everything worked. Where is it? Is this on the road? Where is this this drop? I hear it like to my left or something. Why am I in the middle of the bridge? I didn't even put it here. Ew. Oh, I don't even want that. <laughs> I'm just gonna ignore that. Let's go to some of these. I don't like that it's a night time, but sure. Look. All right. So okay. This is a good first drop. This is a good starter drop. We'll go towards the other one as well. Nice. Nice and quick. I like the way... Yeah, this thing's worse. Should I keep the RS6? Should I do an RS6? You know what? Let's do it. Let's try a full RS6 game for today. See what happens. See if I can win in the RS6. See if it's actually possible. See if it's actually possible to win in the RS6. I've never done it. Like, I've, we've had some close games, so I've never actually won in the RS6 before. And you guys know how I feel about this guy. You guys know how much I love it. So I ought to try and win in it. Try and avoid the river. So, I'm gonna go this way. Eat. Go. Nice and easy. The 911 is good for driving off-road, but I think I have a much better speed going on the road with this thing. Yeah, I overtook him already. Jesus. Okay. Now I just have to be careful. Try not to crash it. Anything. Nice. Good dodge. Okay. Doing good. Doing good. I'm not going to swap from this, though. I'm going to have to stay in the R6 now. Should I play this more safe? Should I, like, just try and kind of position myself in ways that I can try and win. Because I feel like if I don't... Wait, did they make it so it doesn't change gears? I think they might have made it so it doesn't change gears in the Eliminator. I don't know if you guys remember. So basically, they, they fixed the whole changing gears for you, you know, when you don't want it to change gears. Um, or, oh, sorry, the other way around. It's like at the very beginning of the games, or races, or whatever. I was gonna say. Surely it's not gonna be that way. So basically, at the start of races, if you guys remember, you weren't able to change gears from first. You had to like double press it or something like that. And then afterwards, sometimes you start in like reverse and stuff like that. So they hot fixed that, which is good. That's a good thing. But, but, uh, now I think in the Eliminator, they also ended up changing it. So I think. It doesn't auto change gears for you. I don't know if you guys remember every time you finish a race or whatever, it would end up putting it in basically in the gear previous, if that makes sense. So if you were in first gear when you finish the race, it'll put it in reverse a lot of the time. Or if you were in like second, it'll switch into first. You wouldn't be able to see it unless you actually are driving it and then you realize that it's done it. And it's really, really annoying sometimes when you're like trying to get off the line as quickly as possible after you just finish a race and you can't because it just switches you into reverse. I think they might have hotfixed that, because when I was driving this thing now, we just finished that race. So watch, I'm going to try and finish this race in first. <laughs> I'm going to finish this race in first, and we'll see if it puts me in reverse afterwards. Because I, I think they fixed it so it doesn't actually put you in reverse. Okay? So basically now, it should technically put me in reverse, if I drive slow enough. Is it going to do it? No, it's not. So they fixed that. I'm so happy. Man, that was plaguing this game since the start. Since the very beginning of this game. <laughs> this, since this game came out, they literally ended up putting... I was going to call it a feature. It's not a feature. It's a bug. 
they ended up having that bug in the game since then. And I haven't gotten a chance to, to play without it. Should I just drive around the ring? <laughs> Everyone's doing the races and I'm just here. Going around the oval. <laughs> Yay. Wee. <laughs> oh, it's so dumb. Wee. <laughs> Try to drift around the oval. Oh god. Alright, cool. Like I said, I'm staying in the RS6, whatever it takes. So, hopefully it doesn't put the finish line up here. I beg. I beg it doesn't put the finish lines up there, because I really don't want to come off the thing. What's that guy doing? Oh, he's in a car that can actually beat me. He's in a good car. Go for it anyway. Let me go for it anyway. I thought he was in the next fight, but he's actually in a in a Cayenne. Oh no. Nothing's good. Well, it's better than this thing anyway, I'll tell you that. Come on. I pride myself in my tree dodging skills. Basically a straight line here. Just drive in a straight line and I'm good. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, it's so hard to stay ahead of him. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, R6. You absolute beauty, come on. Come on. Come on, come on. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'll take it. Is there someone chasing? I hope not. Bro, I don't want to race these people. I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose so badly. Like, I want to race people, but at the same time, I want to be careful with who I race, because, like... But I'm just going to lose these races. What's he in? Is he in an R6 as well? Did we go R6 versus R6? Okay. Okay, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That thing has so much better acceleration than this thing. So much better. But I think I have better top speed, so I just need to get up to speed. Come on, come on, come on. Get up to speed and stay there. That's all I have to do. Come on. Come on, RS6. Come on. Come on, RS6. <laughs> What's happening? What's happening? There's no way. There's no way. There is absolutely no way. That's stupid. Oh, I don't want to race this guy. I'm going to lose. Oh, I've lost. Yeah, I've lost. I have officially lost. Can I squeeze through the gap? I can. Go. I have officially lost, boys. No. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. That sucks. I knew there was people there, but I was just trying to get out of the way. Bro, sixth place in this thing. <laughs> oh, man. Four limbs as well. I smashed an aerial. I smashed the Cayenne as well. That was a good guy. That was a really good game. <laughs> That's so stupid. That was so stupid. I always, always love playing in the RS6, man. It's so much fun.
It's so much fun playing in that guy. Absolutely humiliating people. I feel like I've made another video like this in the past as well, where I said, I literally call it, I think, humiliating people in the Audi RS6 or something like that. Oh my god, I'm honestly tempted to just name this video the same thing. Just be like, humiliating people in the Eliminator with the RS6. <laughs> Part 2. <laughs> Alright, let's go back and uh, let's see what happens. This is a lot more fun than me winning the actual Eliminator, because I've won a, a stupid amount of games, so I don't really care about winning. But, like, just playing the game and making it so, like, I just have fun playing it. Just playing around with random cars and beating people with cars that I shouldn't be. It's just more fun, in my opinion. Um, Alright, let's go again. <laughs> That was too- that was too good. That was way too fun. Alright, I spotted the- the main festival. I probably shouldn't have. <laughs> There's just nothing here. I want to spawn in different places because I keep spawning in the same places and I just get shafted because I feel like they've changed the way the cars spawn. So those- it's just so irregular now where the cars spawn. There's a drop there. I'm gonna go towards the highway man. There's nothing here. I feel like people are, are already going to be here, and they're already going to take the drops, but whatever. Yeah, I see one all the way over there. That's going to get snatched up before I do anything. Um, what about the little town that's there? I can't remember what it's called. I always forget what it's called. What about the town that's there? That place usually has some sort of drops. I don't care if this guy gets that one. What's the zone looking like? What are we looking at here? Eh, mostly north. Mostly northern side of the map. This guy's just straight up just ignored this shot. I mean, to be honest with you, I would as well. And so I will. There's a drop there. No drop to the left, from what I can see. I don't want to race this guy, but... He did crash. Yeah, he crashed again. My drop. My germs! My germs. Come on. This way. Yes. <laughs> I'm not winning this. Oh, he crashed. He badly crashed. But I'm still not winning this, I don't think. <laughs> not with what I'm driving. Versus what he's driving. Come on. Get over this hill. And it should be good. Yes. Okay. Right. I need to go more to the right so I can avoid all... Whatever that rock face is that's there. All the way around it. There you go. Okay, never mind. I am winning this by the looks of things, because that guy messed up really badly. I don't know what happened to him. How did he get... Did he get stuck in something, maybe? He was stood, like, completely still at one point, because his little... Little icon disappeared. But that thing's so much faster than this guy, as well. First of all, it's much better off-road. Second of all, all-wheel drive, I think. I think it was in there. Was he in an aerial nomad? Because I'm pretty sure that's all-wheel drive. And, uh... It, yeah, just, it, he's, it's, he's just much faster. Hello, Beetle. He's just much faster, but, uh, yeah, I'm, he just made massive, massive mistakes. I don't know what he did. Well, doesn't matter. This is mine now. Level 6, straight off the bat. We take those, we take those. Um. Oh, so it's the exo set. I feel like this thing's even better. Am I a sim steering? I hope I'm not a sim steering because I feel like I'm just gonna mess up so much from my sim steering. I hate every time I drive on sim steering with like uh, any of these like little off roaders. But I, oh, I think I made the on sim steering because they're they're so twitchy off road, and you can like throw yourself off so easily in like some random direction.
At least I'm still I still got the the thing where I'm facing the right direction. For the finish line. At least I still got that in me. <laughs> I feel like that's something I'll never forget though. Like it's just it's just kind of obvious. It's just going the opposite direction of where the edge of the zone is, you know? Is this on the other side? This actually might be on the other side. I may need to... The river's like shallow here though, isn't it? Oh, it's not on the other side. Oh my god. I was gonna say, because I feel like where I'm driving to right now as well, it's... The river's fairly shallow, so I can just... go straight for it. Why is this sending me all the way around? Nice. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Yeah, I think the river here is like shallow enough, I can just go straight through it. What's this drop? I mean, I'll still take the trail cut, but... Oh, yucky. Yucky! Um... Right. No one around me. Not that I can see anyway. There was some arrows here, though. Or, like little markers for people being around here. But they're just gone again. Straight up disappeared. Is this still the McCann or is this like something else now? Is the McCann taken? And it's called far. Yeah. I'm pretty much at the edge of the zone here. The south part. The southern part of the zone. So finish line is going to be anywhere up there. This is very similar actually to the, to the previous zone, am I right? I kind of want to get myself towards like the bit of the highway, if that makes sense. I thought 9 would have been really good. But I'm not going to downgrade with this thing. I'm going to try to get close to a level 10 car. As close as possible, even if I get up to like level 9, if I beat like 2 more people. 2 9 5 9s. Right. 9 9 is so good, man. 959 is really, really good. Well, those guys are just constantly chasing each other, I think, in there. So I'm gonna just cruise for a second. There's arrows up there for people driving. Am I gonna, am I gonna, am I gonna cross anyone here? Like, are, are they just gonna cross over the highway? Because I'm still kind of at the southern part of the, the zone. We'll see where the next area is, actually. Yeah, I knew these guys were gonna race each other. Let's have a quick look and we'll see where the next zone is. Where this shrinks, and then we can try to position ourselves in a way where I can uh, get an advantage of when I'm racing people. Yeah, those guys are just racing across the map just like I did earlier. Okay, okay, we like that, we like that. Come on, come on, touch. 15 players left, not that many. Last lobby was like much smaller than this, I think. Okay, so I'm pretty much set in the right place here to do races. Got a couple more drops here. That's a set up there. And X5. Don't really care for those. There is someone really far out of the way here. I don't know what he's doing. What's he driving? Howdy. Where's he going? What the hell? What is that finish line? Why did it put the finish line there? <laughs> wow, game. You're stupid as hell. Why would you put the finish line there, man? That makes absolutely no sense to me. Literally no sense to me to put the finish line there. Jesus, somehow I outhandled the Audi S1. Oh my god. What a stupid place to put the finish line. Does that mean that the zone's... I think that just means that the zone is going to shrink down here afterwards. What a dumb place for that finish line. I can't even lie, that was just terrible. That was awful. Like, I'm here, and instead of putting the finish line anywhere here, it puts it, like, here. I think the zone's just going to shrink, like, down here, like this. The only problem is I'm going to... I'm in a crappy Camaro. And uh, this thing sucks off-road. 
like really badly sucks off road. So whatever I do here, whatever happens, I need to be very careful. I honestly feel like I need to race someone and, and just get get out of this car. I don't want to be in this car at all. Do I race that guy? Or what? Oh man, I really don't want to stay in this car. This car sucks. Have I ever won in the Camaro? I don't think I've ever won in this in this Camaro before. I think this is one of those cars where I just I never won in. If I move slowly like this, will that guy see me? I don't think so. <laughs> I'm doing a sneak attack here. Nobody knows where I am. I'm just like creeping up here. <laughs> just waiting for someone to come along so I can just race the other direction. Surely, right? Surely they're not going to put the finish line here. It makes absolutely no sense for them to put the finish line here. Oh no, I've popped up on the map. I don't want to stay in this car, man. It's awful. It's absolute piss. God, man. I hate this thing. Is there any way, shape, or form that I can kind of race someone? There's nobody around me that's close. That's the issue here. Is that guy here? Is he driving away from me or not? Sort of. Stuck. I'm stuck in a cactus, for God's sake. See, the thing is, on the road is fine. Like, I can race on the road, but like, off-road, man. As soon as I take this thing off-road, it's piss. It's so bad. Should I just race these people? Oh man, I just want to race someone, please. That guy's in an RSX. He's, he's doing what I was doing the last game, I think. What a legend. What a legend. What's this guy in a Jeep? Oh my god, bro. He's spamming that button. He's, I can hear him just spamming his horn. thought it'd be funny to try to challenge him. I knew it was the end of the game as well. <laughs> oh, don't push me. Oh, I got no habit. Got no habit. Oh, no. I have to get on the highway ASAP. Stop. Stop rolling. Thank you. Let's just put it straight up north. Come on. Oh no. Oh no. It's at the other end of the highway. I'm not winning this. Those guys are gone. They're straight up gone. As long as they, they don't crash it, then they have this. Like, there's nothing I can do here. I got put in such a bad position here. Oh, it's not even at the other end of the highway. It's like. For the mark to the right. I'm not gonna cut yet because there's lots of trees and shit in the way, but I'll cut in a sec. I'll cut straight after this bridge.
Oh, see if I can remember where the gap is. It's like somewhere right in the middle here. Oh, I didn't guess it. Oh, I didn't get it right. Oh. <laughs> there is a gap right in the middle. Is this the gap? I think this is the gap that I'm talking about. Yeah, I've lost it. God damn it, man. Oh, why did I get stuck in this shitty Camaro? <laughs> First of all, I got stuck in this Camaro. Second of all, I got stuck in, on top of like a hill. <laughs> oh, that was dumb. Alright, we'll take that. Fuck it. Who cares? We'll move on. Okay. Third time. Is, I'm not gonna say it. 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 Here, drop behind me. I spawned kind of next to the highway, kind of where I usually spawn. I can't even see this. Plus, someone's taken already. So I'm going this way. I'll take this drop. Ooh! We do take this drop. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, boys. What's the, uh, what's the sound looking like? Oh. R7 as our first drop. Yes, please. Yes, 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 yes. Alright. I'm a happy customer. Let's go. Get this stuff out of the way. Already in level 7. Not that many people playing the Eliminator, I guess. Uh, I mean, it is technically right now. Oh my god, another R7. It is technically right now. Kind of like school hours. It's literally midday. And it is during a weekday as well, so it's, it is technically school hours. So I, I can see why, or even like work hours, like even for for older people that are playing this game, I have a job. Like, see why I'm playing this? Like, I'm playing this game like in the middle of the day, basically, on a weekday. So it's uh, it's understandable that there's not that many people playing it. Damn, our sevens. Good. Oh! <laughs> our sevens good. We'd like the R7. Okay. What's our what's our level seven guy? Give me something good. Come on. Oh, hello. Oh. Oh. This, bro. What's my guy doing in the X7? Or X5? Fuck up, race me. Let's race. X5 is good off road. But I think this has a better, like, just better speed overall compared to the X5. The only thing is that this is, this is dog shit off road. And it's only good on road. But. If I get myself on this road, I keep my speed up a little bit, at least. At least for a little while. Have a nice little gap between the trees here. like this, we like this, nice open fields. Don't mind if this thing is bad off-road, as long as I get nice, like a nice open field. We take that. And now we slow down, because we don't have to go full speed, because we're way ahead. Nice! Oh, and he's left anyway, so it doesn't matter. That's good. That's good. SV, we take... We take the, the Mercy SV. Things better at everything. I'm at the edge of the zone now. Uh, I guess all I have to do is just kind of look for someone to race and then we'll move on towards the left side of the map. There is someone all the way out there in the middle of the field. Is that the R6? Oh my 
gosh. <laughs> Imagine if I just took the R6. Is that crash? Challenge the mini. Definitely challenge that mini. That mini is Kaka. Let's gonna challenge it. Oh, good hop. Straight over the puddle. Very nice. Very, very nice. I kind of avoid all the crap that's here. I probably could have avoided a better But there's like a puddle there and there's some rocks and some, some shit over there, so... I kind of went wide just to avoid all that stuff. A couple of hot and things here. Yep, that's the one thing I was worried about, but that's okay. How many is so slow, but I can stop, go for a nap, and then wake up and then continue the race and I'll still win. That's the good thing about this race. Alright. What are we now? 11-9? Come on, give me a rally car. I don't want the stupid Jeep. Just don't give me the Jeep. Take it. Good. Definitely take this. This is sick car. I think the Focus is faster, though. Is it faster? I need the Hoonigan cars are very good, but I think the Focus might be faster. I think the... Right, uh, I think the worst one is probably the Jeep, right? This is the, yeah, I think the Jeep. The Fiesta's good as well. Pretty sure that's a level 9. And then you have the Focus as well. As well as this thing. And then you have the Andretti Beetle as well, which again is also stupidly good. A bunch of arrows here, that's how I'm going this way. Bunch of arrows. Can I tell if that guy's racing someone? I think he might actually be racing someone. I will, however, go towards the highway. Yeet. Okay, there is someone here. Hello! Oh my god. I was trying to turn around. I thought it was at that end of the highway. And sometimes they just put it there. I guess not. Nice, right, level 10. Give me Hoonigan RS. Hoonigan RS or the Brocky? Hoonigan RS or Brocky? Come on. Hoonigan Brocky. Hoonigan Brocky. Actually, even if I take the Centenario or something like that. Because I think our finish line is going to be on the highway. Yeah, come on. <laughs> Whatever. I think the last time that I played this, someone said, why wouldn't I take the Centenario? You know, why would I stay in the level 9 car? So now I'm going to take the Centenario. But it's worse off-road. However, I know where the finish lines are on on these zones that I'm playing on right now. I know exactly where the finish lines are. Is that guy chasing? I don't think he is. I don't think he's chasing. But I know where the finish lines are. There's one that's going to be like here somewhere. And I'm exactly where I am right now as well. Oh, if I could catch that guy, that would be so sick. Where's that guy? See? <laughs> that's, that's why I automatically turned off the highway, because I know where this finish line is. And then there's two finish lines back there. I think there's one on the highway. I don't think the, the one on the highway is, is actually there now because I think it's... I think the zone shrunk kind of past it, if that makes sense. Ew. Fuck up. Then I'm gonna rest. Nah. I'm actually gonna go this way. I know that the Hoonigan... Oh, I was gonna say, I know that the Hoonigan RS is gonna chase me, but he's not. I wish he was, because I would've won this. 
I would have won this really easily if you did. Wait, is this the final sh No, it's not. It needs to deal with one more time. Again, I'm going to try and play this the safe way. So basically, we do the same thing. Just go back to the same point that I was on the highway. And then we know that the finish line is going to be there again. In the exact same place. And I'll do the exact same race again if I have to. So that's really, really easy to, to control the outcome of that race. Is there anyone down here just hiding? No? No, there isn't. So yeah, the finish line is going to be over there to the right. And you, I think you see these two guys there. Come to the door. Yep, there you go. And they've just finished the race. So now it's going to be four people left in this lobby. We'll see where the zone shrinks now next. I mean, I'm all for doing races, but not when you're, like, doing that to me. Should I just try trying something else? There's nobody else. I think everyone's just hiding. I think everyone's just straight up hiding here. There's not a single person on the minimap. <laughs> oh, no. These guys are out of the zone. Way out of the zone. What's happening here? They're not even like racing each other or anything. I don't think that guy's actually still up the drops. Is he? Come on, we gotta eliminate at least one of them. Come on, Chitraria. Be the better off road car. <laughs> Somehow that worked. Somehow that actually worked. How? How did that even work? Something with this guy. What's he doing up here? Oh, he's chasing you, stupid bitch. This guy dead ass just chased me. Oh, I hope he crashes now. Because of that. You stupid little bitch. He dead ass just chased me. Wow. You little virgin. He seriously chased me down. I got beaten by a 13 year old. Ah! <laughs> nah, I'm messing. That was, that was actually kind of good. We take that. We take that. Damn it, man. Yeah, I mean, like, he saw his chance to try and beat me, and he did. You know? I was just trying to go for limbs because it's, it's fun. But, like, bro just went and, like, stood there forever, and then he just started chasing me down. So he caught the right time when I was just out of the way, facing the wrong direction and all that shit. Yeah. Well, anyway, that's it for the Eliminator, I guess, for today's video. Thank you for watching, everybody. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos, like this on the channel, then, of course, subscribe as usual. But for now, that's pretty much it. Anyway, that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye, everyone.